I see them as four songs like written in a circle, um, like throughout the year in a way, starting with spring, which is obvious spring, and then September, and then the Beim Schlafen gehen and Im Abendrot. So it, like it goes in a circle in a way for different ways of saying goodbye and different ways of looking at, looking at how the changes are. Like when we go into spring or when we go into summer or the fall and and I've used that a lot as sort of trying to bind them together. Um, and I worked with it for, I mean, since I studied at the Opera Academy in my first year. And as a master's, I sort of wanted to use those songs as an example of, or as a study of how to get into this text, because they're, the music is so obvious and you, you hear so much when you listen to it that you have a hundred of pictures, but to really get to understand what the poems are about, I wanted to sort of find a way to get it a little bit down to earth and a little bit down to how I can make you feel the same way or, or, or sort of understand them without actually understanding the exact words, if it, if it makes sense. Um, and I think that's what I've done the most, especially with, with like the, those texts and those songs because they are so they've been recorded so many times by so many wonderful singers and you wonder do you really need another one but then I feel that my my version of it also could be in the in the in the market in a way and even though I am one of the younger ones who recorded them I I also think that even even if I am young, I am still sort of entitled to to know about those feelings that these songs represent because it's written by a man who's in the end of his life, in the end of his career, watching someone die and watching the fact that he will lose his loved ones and that this life is now over, this is, this is the end. Well, it's not necessarily a, a sad or a bad thing, it's sort of an... Um, a goodbye, but I think even though I'm not 85, <laughs> can't remember his age, but even though I'm not uh, as old as he was, I still can relate to those feelings. The feelings of things changing, the feelings of someone dying, the feeling of, of my life going from one place to another. And I think that's why we should also sort of allow ourselves to to feel those feelings but also say that even though the younger generation ha doesn't have the experience we still have the the same feelings <laughs>